Hey guys, welcome back. This is my third race for the day. Laguna Seca, MX5, last day of week 13. Let's do this. Matt Malone is in this race and he hasn't qualified, so let's watch him pile through the field. Just a week 13 fun race, remember? <laughs> That's right. Exactly. Wow, thank you, Matt Malone. And yeah, so car 19. Uh, second last, but qualified in lucky 13th. Good luck, everyone. I think we're the air temp is 19 I apologize for Celsius, my language. 13th place. Okay, Glenn, are you ready? Yeah, Watch for the lights. Let's do this. Floor it. So I learned a lot from Matt, actually, watching his streams on... On your right. How to change gears. Also getting some steady. advice from uh, my YouTube right. fellowship. They... Right side. Clear right. You're clear. Thank you. Clear wide. You're in the middle. Clear left. Clear all around. Well, that didn't go well. We don't have to worry about aero damage. So yeah, if you want to watch more interesting streams, I try to make it as interesting as possible on Twitch, but uh, Matt Malone is a pro. He's been doing it for years. Ladies first. Car right. Clear right. There he goes. Right side. Still there. Clear right. So that white car ahead, that's who you want to watch. Matt Malone. World champion. If you check out his livery, <laughs> he's got the certificate to prove it. Let's see what we can do with this. Well, I'm up on the last lap. Go get him, Glenn. Oh, Will Scott. <laughs> Matt is surrounded. It's like they're bullying him. <laughs> oh, he's going very deep inside. As he would call it, a gaggle. Did that guy jump? But this car is so much fun on this track. Just done a one thirty seven point four two. Now I better get in and uh, get my hands a bit dirty, I think. I need to uh, make up some time.
The gap in front is now 0.7. Oh, oh, Glenn, come on, track limits. There we go. That's what we want to see. Bit of scoop them up. Oh, Matt's off. Oh, sorry about that. I didn't give you enough room. Incident in rainy curve. I overtook Matt Malone. <laughs> the leader has just done a 137.23. We're halfway home. Fuel looks okay. <clears throat> P13. Two spots. I get top ten here, I'll be happy. You don't really want to go three wide up here, which means we have to back off. We need to push if we're going to hold this position. Right side. Still there. I'm going to take it. Hold your line. Clear, clear to the right. Good work, mate. Keep it up. Thanks, buddy. But I think I'm going to get past so all that hard work. Go inside, man. B12. Left side. Clear left. Thank you. So he used to have this uh, group TV, which is something that him and Jimmy Broadbrent started, uh, livery. But he's uh, quite proud of his achievements. What do I do? Just make him nervous. Oh. Going for a jump. Here we go, come on. You've got ten minutes of fuel remaining. <laughs> Matt's fan. Far right. Clear right. Track limits, come on, keep it between the white lines. I'm happy with a pass like that. Come on, turn. Let's go, Knackers. Let's do it. Okay, Glenn, you've got half your fuel left. That's cool. 
He went for a dive bomb that was never going to make it, so that means his spot is compromised now. Oops, turned in early. And now Fabian's got it. Mad again. Damn, 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 damn. Last lap. I think Fabian behind me has been in all three races that I've been in today. Better not stuff this corner up. Don't do it, mate. Left side. Clear left. Zero X, but still ten X. Wow. Jesus Christ. I had to move it over then before the kink because it's not really a too wide corner. We think P2's binned it in turn one. Right, Joshua. Uh, good racing there, guys. Looks like the leader's binned it in. The Andretti hairpin, P12. Okay, it's over. Thought I had you there in this course group, or... Don't know how the hell you made that work. <laughs> that was good fun, guys. It's been a great week 13. Looking forward to the season tomorrow. See if we can't catch Matt. Yeehaw. Yeah, I've had a lot of fun this week. Just, I don't usually do the MX-5s. I'm just really enjoying the car, but uh, just not having to worry so much about I rating and championship position and points and drop rounds. If the um, MX-5 is going to keep racing like this... <laughs> Look out for the pit speed. What an entry! Now that is how you enter the pits. <laughs> so let's see what the damage is. What we finished, P12, car 19. Might actually get a couple of I-rating points out of this. <laughs> I'm going to have a look at that. Where's me? Uh... This is how you enter the pits at Laguna Seeker, everyone. Let's drop it in. Perfect. Under speed. Dropped it right in. No X. <laughs> Let's see what the damage is. Three minutes to five. 
like a glove. That's exactly right. 3,200 strength of field. See what happens when you got... Um, I was explained to Scott before about strength of fields. And that is an average of everyone. You got me, I was card 19 down to 2,300, but you're racing against people with uh, 6,800, 52, 62, 50, and that really raises it up. And it means that when you finish in 12th, <laughs> you still get some I rating. Uh-oh, I'm down to 1.52. That's not good. I might lose my class A. Oh, well. It's all uphill from here. But yeah, Malone's 41.68. So he was under 4,000 earlier in the week. He's clawed his way back. So yeah, give us a thumbs up if you liked it. Down if you didn't, make sure you subscribe or check my stream out, which I'm hopefully going to be on each day. I've had Scott with me almost the whole time. Thanks for joining me, mate. Really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, I'll end the recording right now. See you next time.